Alright, so a Jubilee. Jubilee is the year at the end of seven cycles of Shemitah. So, Shemitah is seven, so seven times seven. According to biblical regulations, the special impact of the ownership and management of land in the land of Israel, according to the book of Leviticus. So, so land. Land is to do with the Jubilee. <coughs> Um, ownership and management of the land. All right, Hebrew slaves and prisoners would be freed, debts would be forgiven, and mercies of God would be manifest. All right, so that's what a jubilee, a jubilee is for: the ownership and management of land, and freed prisoners. All right, and God would be manifest. All right, so um, what else we got? Jubilee. The word jubilee is derived from the Hebrew word jobel, which means ram's horn, since it was precisely that horn which was used as a trumpet, whose sound indicated to everyone the beginning of a jubilee year. All right. So <clears throat> now I don't know if everyone realizes when the white horse rides, Jerusalem gets destroyed, and the Jews become prisoners, right? And they're supposed to leave their land as well for seven years, and they're taken off their land. And they leave the land for seven years because they didn't let it rest. All right, and if and this, what everybody's saying is a jubilee year. If this event happens on a jubilee year and the Jews are going to being prisoners and are not freed, then why would it be a jubilee year? All right, so um, uh, or you lot number crunches with your calculators and that, telling me I'm not spirit led, but. The thing is, uh, I know my, I know my Abba, right? And this, this is what he's saying. He's saying, um, that's what jubilees are for. So if um, he's going to have a manilial reign, right? I'm, I'm not talking about your number crunching. I'm talking about the manilial reign. So if he's going to have a manilial reign, it'll be because he's taking over ownership, right? It'll be because he's freeing everybody, right? And uh, and he will be manifest. <laughs> so that that's the if you're going to start your reign, um, it's going to be, you know, on a jubilee, and not on a Tuesday, just because somebody wants to be raptured on a jubilee year because it sounds cool. Uh, like uh, we've heard all this stuff before. You're all excited. Oh, the calculator saying. Um, but these have all been wrong before using that exact same calculator. Alright, so anyway, don't get too excited. <laughs> God bless.